Yo, what's going on gamers, friends of hands, Gaming up there here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to grind Warman bits, Warmind bits, and the fastest way to obtain and achieve Warmind bits is to freaking do the, um, daily repeatable bounties. So, you go down here and approach, and this is going to be the fastest way to grind Warmind bits. The bounties will be the obviously the legendary yes, beyond here. Easy is one of the hardest ones and public certainly be easy. It's pretty easy. If you want to add me to PlayStation and I will help you. Obviously get these war mind bits, but this is what we're after. The additional bounties. They give you ten per and you get five of them like every four so on and so forth but the main things you want to buy is one my bit generation tier one and then cost reduction tier one i basically went to one my bit generation tier one and then automatically bought the one my bit generation tier two i will be buying the tier three momentarily as soon as i reach 300 just so i get more war mine bits faster that's what it's about but uh this video is the fastest way to grind more men, more mine bits. So obviously you click up the five and since it's the start of the season, everybody's gonna be wondering how do you grind more mine bits the fastest? Well I've been watch I've watched every single video that I've found that said claims they have the fastest way. But my way they say PvP is the fastest, but my way I've recorded it and I can get about 150 to 200 in an hour of where my bits. So you'll obviously look solar, shotguns, grenade launchers, melee, and grenades. Okay, so you set up your loadout like that. So you grab a grenade launcher, I you just bought that. You grab a shotgun, and you grab a Solar, shotgun, grenade launcher, melee. Okay, so we're gonna highlight grenades, we're gonna highlight melees, we're gonna highlight solar. Well, I'm not gonna highlight solar, we're just gonna highlight what I need to start on. So, we're not gonna be using my primary at all, so let's just put on something that I know I'm not going to use. Arbalus, because not Arbalus, we're gonna get a shotgun right there. So, we're not gonna be wanting to do it here on EDZ. No, D. Over to the moon. This is obviously the fastest way of doing it. We're not going to the moon. We want to go to Soros or Harbor. Or we want to hit these public events. That, that's what you want to do. Go to the moon and do that. You don't want to go to PvP. It's, it's, it's a shit show. Like, actually, if you want to go into PvP, you can fucking drop a launcher or grenade launcher. And just be there, even though you'll probably get two two points for for uh, one, but ten, but ten to twenty, anywhere from ten to fifty kills, that's that's nothing. Ten to fifty is nothing. Anywhere from fifty and above, well, yeah, then I'd say go into PvP if it's double. Like if you're getting two per, and it's only twenty five to only twenty five kills. If you're doing between 10 and 30, don't go into PvP. Just just do it in the open world. I think some of these are 50, aren't they? Yeah. So, yeah, see 80? 80 solar kills is pretty easy. Just use a subclass, and just use a gun that's solar. It's plain and simple. I'd recommend hard light if you want to do solar kills. Just use hard light. Or just grab an rifle that's solar. Or grab an oxygen. Or Grab a Plyros Prometheus Lens. That that works too. But I advise you not to go on PvP because it's just it's just a slaughter fest. You you're not gonna get, you're, the likelihood of you getting heavy every single time is one out of fifty. You've got the people to, you're gonna grab heavy before you. So there's no point to go on PvP and try to pick up the heavy and see boom. I already have some people here. This makes it a lot easier. And these 
things can spawn a lot. There is another way of doing them, but uh, it's not the uh, weekly this week, so... It's going to be there for, for a while. And this is a sparrow you can buy for the daily buy sparrow. It's, it's a pretty nice sparrow. I like this one. I'm rocking last year. I like the look of it. That's why I'm rocking it. Keep going through here. I'm trying to think of areas that um, will make things go a million times faster. That's fun, like. Keep running around. 
around him. Can we just go to um, the moon, the, not the moon, Titan, and wait for the Hive ritual too? Something that spawns a lot of things, that's what you want to do. I find the moon has been the fastest for me. And that's just me. Just because of the amount of stuff that spawns on the moon. Okay, shotgun's down. So now let's use my grenade launcher. I'm just gonna put that on because it's solar. Well, this would take much longer. You just keep running around. That's all you do. That was a group kill. So obviously this is a barrier guy. Basically, follow these tiny tunnels around and keep killing stuff around them. I'm not sure about this tunnel, but we're just gonna keep going. We're bound to run into more enemies. All right, so we've got. That's stinking accurate. is there down here that we can kill? Not much. Alright, back through. Go through this tunnel. Basically, just gonna keep going through tunnels. So we're at 47 of 8. Like, that, that's pretty fast. Let's see, we're on the other side of the map. Now what we're gonna want to do is... Keep following this tunnel. Kill whatever's over here. Now go this way. Basically follow what I do in this video. You'll be well on your way to grind out more of my bits. Like on average it probably takes about 15 minutes for 5 quests, if not less. Whatever, however the length of this video is, that's how long it takes me. Keep going through here. We're already at 64 of 80. Then all that's left is our grenades and melees. That's it. That's all it takes. Now, depending on your quests, um, it will it will vary on um, 
how long it takes. But for the most part, just follow what I do. You'll be fine. The reason why I'm not shooting their heads is because I want them uh, grouped up, so we're just gonna get a grenade kill here. How did you not die from that grenade? Whatever. We're dead now. So we got 3 of 8 grenade kills. And we're at 73 of 80 solar. Now these are the one of the easier ones to do the badge. Melee kills being easy because it takes like no skill. Okay. So instead of teleporting, we're just gonna walk around. Just so you guys get a thing. Generally do that. This is just to kill some time. Just to uh, make it seem like a little bit lengthier because obviously you might have you might get stuck with five guns or four guns on a super. Super one is by far one of the harder ones because you got you gotta get ten kills with a super and there's not many supers out there that last the length of getting twenty kills with a super. I've been I've been managing to achieve roughly roughly eleven to fourteen with one gold numbers. That's by just saving it and doing it with an entire group of ads rather than like just doing it on a single ad. You guys want to group up for me? Come on. Group up. No, yeah, that's right. Group up. Come on. Group the hell up. Find it. Alright, solar's done. So now let's work on some melee and grenade kills. Oh, we got a big get. We got some here and here. Come on, quit hiding on me. Come here. So that's 7 out of 20 melees, 3 out of 8 make grenades. Try to do my nades in, in a group. My group's a 2 or more. Obviously, a better build for this would be uh, run like max. Whatever gives you. I don't. I run pretty much pretty high melee build. Because I am I am a hunter, so I kind of want your throwing knife as fast as possible. Or two of that fact, if you really, really feel like you want to just destroy. Here we come to a wizard. I'm gonna lose that. Miss the wizard. Come on, go back into my, go back into my throne knife. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, bye bye. Fine. Right, go this way. How many more grades? Five, six, seven, eight. So get a group of three. How many more melee? Like Seventeen or twenty. So two more. No, three more. Three more melee. Three more grades. There's one melee. There's two melees. So now it's just the grenades. See, all we want to do is just get our grenade up. Now, obviously, that was a failed attempt by me. 
what is over here? Oh, Lost Sector. Alright, well, I guess we're gonna Lost Sector then. Time to get up here. I have my grenade fully recharged. Come on. Recharge my nade. Come on. Honestly, I'm just speedrunning this. Come here. All right. your friend. Come on. These are also good things to actually, actually this would be actually a perfect thing for um Because there's actually a fair decent amount of ads inside this one. process over and over and over and over and over and over and over again until either you get bored or you have everything done. Before I stop the rating, I will show you what a Babel level will look like. One that would be very freaking hard to do. So hopefully the next step I grab will be a harder one. Expect um, for your first time, I think you have an hour to um, complete complete this set of five. But obviously, it actually does not take that long. It doesn't take me this long or how long the video is going to be. But I, 
have his main spin around half this time. Because most people are not going to just go for it. Not really, but not really. But 99% of them are going to die. For some people. And also, you can't take out the travel time, take out the um, all the time I talked to the front. And take all that out. rather than goofing off. That's just me though. But another plus thing is having the That helps a lot when it comes to doing these, not having to go in your vault or your inventory, just going in to yourself. Time to turn them in. Time to 284. Oh, come on. One more set. So I'll show you what a possibly hard set's going to be. That, that's another easy set, but this one is actually pretty heavy based. So we got a bow, we got a sword, we got a rocket launcher, we got a sidearm, so we got a melee. So, how I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna run a bow special. Special move. We don't need the hand cannon because I had that out for something. Decided, you know what? I don't want it. So here's how I run my loadout for this. Transfer that to vault. And I'm gonna grab my Arsendic Bite. Fox transfer to Hunter. Retail Fox would be actually much better for this, so that's that's how you grind them fast, guys. If, if it helps, leave a comment down below, and if it doesn't help and you need me to rework it, I've I've got many, many, many more that I can do a video on uh, to help you guys uh, and gals perfect at being better at this game and making this season well worth your uh, time. So, this is Gaming Empire, uh, as always, um, peace.